<laughs> ah, look at who is there, the master. He has to say something at the end of the video. What do you want to tell to the people like do after the, this day, the, the this day in Medjugorje? What do you want to tell the people? It really ignites your faith. It brings an awareness yeah. to the current times that we live in. It makes you think and reason with <laughs> the authenticity of the Catholic Church and the tradition of how we live out of faith. The centre part of the centrality of our faith yeah. is the medicine of immortality. It is Jesus Christ, the bread of life. When we come to meet Christ in the Eucharist, we come to the fulfilment of what Christ did for us in Calvary. And from that, we get the grace to continue to spread the love of Christ that endures within us, to give to others. We are called to be universal with the people of this world that Jesus Christ is your divine saviour. He died for a reason. He came and resurrected from the dead for a reason. And that reason is to give you life, life eternal. Meanwhile, during the course of your life until the day of eternity, live in living the Eucharist. Christ is the Eucharist. He's ever present. He is ever present for you. Mm -hmm. Come and eat. Come and eat with Jesus. Feed off Jesus. Mary, the mother of God, is asking us to come to her son. And for everyone, wherever you are in this world, if you are lapsed in Catholicism, reconcile. Reconcile with Jesus through the church, through the priest in the sacrament of reconciliation and come to the altar the sacrifice come to the altar of sacrifice and receive the medicine of immortality in Jesus holy name Amen, Amen. you want to say anything about the five stones for the people? the five stones yeah, of Medjugorje, can you explain them in detail? I, I can um, one of the greatest gifts that the world has received from heaven coming to earth in Medjugorje for your Blessed Mother. The Gospel, as, as she's known here in Medjugorje, is that she has given us the five stones. The five stones is a daily way of living. And those five stones are, first of all, there's a sacrament of reconciliation. That is monthly. There is the Holy Eucharist, receiving the Holy Eucharist weekly. It is the daily rosary, all the mysteries of the rosary. It is praying and fasting, Wednesdays and Friday, on bread and water. And then there's a sacred scripture, feeding off the word of God, the word made flesh, and dwelt among us. Those five stones are the very basic foundation of what our Blessed Mother has given us to contend with the way that the, the, the world has developed and evolved in the way that the subtleness of it drawn you away from the sacramental life. The five, the five stones is a powerful foundation of living. And I can assure you, if you live out the five stones, you're given a spiritual weapon for these times. Father Yozo, in the early days, eloquently put his reasoning as to why the five stones were essential for meeting your Goliath. And these five stones, I can assure you, will give you life and feed you spiritually to be able to love and receive the grace of the Father through His Son, in Jesus. Amen. Amen. Wonderful. Thank you so much.